All right, so last week I talked to you about the importance of being tall as a runner, your posture, how critical that is. So as we get started this week, quick check. How's your posture right now? Are you sitting tall? Are you slumping? Make sure you're nice and tall. Stay on that. Stay really focused because it's not just when we're running we want to be thinking about it. It's all the time so really continue to think about that posture continue to work on all those components of the running stride that we talked about from head to toe that are super important now one way we're going to reinforce that this week is by introducing you to the ABC running drills now these are fundamental drills that you should be doing every week from now until forever these aren't just a learn and start and then you can forget them these are drills you'll do forever as a runner it's kind of like when you are a golfer and you're learning how to golf no matter how many years you've golfed for you tend to go to the driving range and hit a whole bunch of balls the more you do the better you get the better feel you have the better your swing is you start to train that muscle pattern and that's the exact same thing we're looking to do with running drills so the ABC drills are fundamental. You're going to find that there's various different forms of the ABC drills, but these at the essence are the, the most basic versions of what I want you to do. So I'm going to take you outside. I'm going to show you what each piece looks like, and then we'll come back and I'll give you some homework for the week. So let's head outside and I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, so let's take a look at the ABC drills broken down into each one, starting with the A step. What we're looking for here is a high knee drive, picking your feet up flat off the ground, driving those feet right back under your hips. So think about really getting those knees high, driving in a straight line, really pushing those feet under your hips, landing on your midfoot. Really focus on engaging your arms and keeping your head up throughout the entire drill. Now when we move to the B step, it's gonna feel very similar to the A, but the difference here is we're almost pedaling through, reinforcing a powerful pulling through of that stride. So it's gonna feel like pawing the ground or like a horse pawing the ground, something like that I want you to visualize as you do this. Focus on getting your feet right back under your hips. The C step, also called butt kicks, as you'll see here, we're really trying to get those heels up, moving our feet quickly, and literally trying to kick your own butt. So I want you to think about leaning forward, being nice and tall, landing on your midfoot while you're doing this drill. All right, so those are the ABC drills. Pretty straightforward. Here's the catch though, they're gonna feel a little strange the first time you do them, especially the B. As you get into that one, it's gonna feel really odd. And that's okay, it's totally normal. The more you practice these, the more natural it's gonna feel. Just like swinging a golf club for the first time, it doesn't feel right. The grip feels funny, the swing doesn't come naturally. That's gonna be the same thing in these running drills and I want you to stay with them. So here's your homework this week. I want you to, from now on, till the end of this training program, and for your life as a runner for that matter, I want you doing these drills twice a week. You pick which days you're gonna do them. Ideally, you're doing them right before a workout so that you really reinforce what we're looking for in the stride. Really focus on good posture, good technique, being nice and tall, confident, and working on all the components we talked about last week, bringing those into these drills. So hopefully that helps. It'll make a huge difference the more you do these. So get your ABCs done this week, and we'll talk to you soon.